friends and welcome back to Bitfumes. In this episode, we are going to start our API series and going to install Laravel and obviously going to create the GitHub repository for this project so that you will get all the source code on GitHub. So with that, I am your host Sarthak and this is a channel where I talk about Laravel and the cool thing about Laravel. So if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and like Bitfumes on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. So obviously we need Laravel. So if you have not installed Laravel yet, you can go to get started and installation documentation of Laravel.com and here you can see there are firstly requirement is composer. You need to install the composer on your machine. So this is the website and there is the download system and obviously I also have a video for downloading the Laravel 5.4 even 5.5. So you can get the link in the description and then after you have to run this command so that you can get this Laravel new command to create a new Laravel project. Alternatively you can also download project via this command using the composer only. So why not create that project? So I will say Laravel new, let's call it eAPI. That's represent e-commerce API. Okay, so eAPI, that's good. And hit return. It will download the API Laravel 5.5 for our machine and while it's installing let's go to github.com so i will go to github.com slash bitfumes my github repository and here i'm going to create a new repository here so let's create a new repository and i will call it uh, let's say simple as simple as that api nothing else and description uh, let's say create e-commerce uh, restful API that's great and obviously it's a public it's for you only so create repository and let's see what is that yeah level is successfully installed that's great and what we have to do we have to push that project in our bitfume slash API repository so why not go to this terminal and firstly I will go cd into that eAPI folder and now I will say git init. Obviously you have git installed on your project if you want to follow me on the github system then you have to go to git and then git hyphen scm.com go to git then you can download that according to your machine that means windows and then if you are on mac everything is available here that's great so let's go here git in it that's okay then i will say git add readme.md great once more i will say git firstly let's check status everything we have to push to the machine but before doing all these things i will open the project in sublime so for that i will go here and open that in sublime go to this git ignore.com and i will also remove this vendor so that you will get everything we have on the vendor so if you want to download my repository you will get each and everything that's cool so let's go close that here say git status and this time vendor is also included here so that's good and now i will say git commit and before commit we have to add so git add all and this will add everything to our local repository that's cool see everything is added so i will say status git status sorry yeah and everything is here now it's time for git 
commit with a m flag of message called initial commit that should be like this and it's done great now let's see what we have to do we have to run this command and like this hit enter then push everything to master and yes it will push everything to our master that means on github now we can see our github our project is now successfully pushed to github repository let's refresh here and you will see everything is here and obviously I will add a readme file I think I have added and I will edit it so that you can see what exactly this project is so we will meet in the next episode to start our first system of creating the Laravel API Laravel e-commerce restful API so if you have any doubt Feel free to message me and comment me on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram and we will meet in the next episode to start something cool. Until then, goodbye.